Well, first and foremost, it's uh, significant because it's, it's no easy feat. In order to land on Mars' the surface, this lander and rover had to go through what is referred to in, in uh, the space world as being the, the seven or nine minutes of terror. That's a, a communications blackout while the rover is landing on Mars' surface, where the, the station back on Earth has no idea what's happening and uh, all the, pr the maneuvers are entirely automated. And uh, half of these attempts have failed uh, so far, uh, and China is only the third third country to have managed to do that after the United States and the USSR. And actually, China had failed in a previous attempt about uh, 10 years ago. So this uh, shows that uh, China and the U.S. are in a race to become the world's uh, global tech leader and that China is uh, fast catching up. Um, we've seen it in the, over the past few years uh, in China's space program, with China launching its first uh, quantum satellite and then uh, China landing on the far side of the moon and bringing back some lunar samples back to Earth. And finally, uh, recently, in the past uh, few weeks, we've seen China starting to build its own uh, space station. So China is clearly more than a contender in a new space race. And uh, Xi Jinping, the Chinese president, has congratulated the team behind this latest mission. And he'll no doubt be happy to see how independent China's space program is at a time of increased uh, uh, tensions in international relations. So the rover has now touched down. That's a very difficult part over and done with. What's that rover planning to do now, Xia? Well, uh, it's, uh, it's landed on uh, the Utopia plane in the northern hemisphere of Mars, which was uh, created likely by a meteor impact. And this means that it was likely uh, where there used to be water on Mars's, Mars's surface. So uh, the lander and rover will probably be keeping an eye on, on ice distribution uh, on the Martian uh, surface. Uh, and, and this likely for a future, this could be useful for any future manned uh, missions on, on Mars. Uh, so over the next 30 days, this rover is going to be uh, collecting data and sending it back to Earth using uh, some of its seven instruments, including cameras, uh, ground penetrating radar, and uh, magnetic field detectors. So uh, a really important uh, mission here uh, with some scientists here in, uh, in China explaining that uh, uh, Mars could have many answers to a number of questions relating to, uh, um, to uh, the Earth's evolution in, uh, in the future. Uh, so really uh, a lot of uh, a lot at stake here uh, for China, the Chinese space program.